Hello and welcome. In these videos we're making a neglected Dickinson stove run like new again. In part one I showed you how to disassemble and clean the valve. And in this video I'm going to clean out the burner pot and the fuel line. We start by pulling out the superheater followed by the burner ring. Underneath those our burner pot is coated in carbon and soot, the results of unbalanced combustion which I'm attacking with a wire brush. You want to brush pretty aggressively. What we're doing is just making sure no carbon is still clinging to the metal of the burner pot. If you have a vacuum, you're going to want to use that for this next bit. If not, uh, grab a rag and start scooping out the debris in the bottom of the burner. You want to keep going until you've gotten 90% of it out. To get the very last of the debris, you can pour in a little diesel fuel and use a rag to soak up the mess. Next we're going to remove the fuel line that connects the burner pot to the valve. We're doing this because there's always a good chance that lines under the stove are plugged. With the fuel line removed, we're going to make sure the T fitting under the burner pot is clear as well. The T has a removable plug, but in cases where it's hard to get to, you can cheat and blow through it with a hose. If you can get a good amount of air through the fuel line, fuel is going to face no obstacles in getting through either. The fuel line I'm reinstalling here is new, but the old one could have been cleaned out and reused. Bring the fuel line up to perpendicular before you finish tightening. Next we're going to put the valve back on. To stop the fitting on the bottom of the valve from turning, make sure you use two wrenches when reattaching the fuel line. Now we're going to reattach the overflow and the incoming fuel lines. In the next video, things are going to get even messier as we tackle the chimney and chimney cap of this old stove. If you enjoyed this video, stay tuned to see this old stove burn beautifully again. And if you found this video helpful, please hit subscribe for more content like this.